Hello everyone, welcome back to the Driver Mod. On today's video, we're gonna be doing an oil change on this 2006 Ford Fusion with the three liter V6 engine, and we're gonna show you how to do it. Before we get started, make sure you hit like, subscribe, and comment down below, and uh, let us know how we're doing here on the channel. And if you are a new subscriber, hit that notification bell so you don't miss a future upload. We do a lot of stuff here, how-tos, DIYs, automotive related content. So let's get to it. So this is gonna be what you pretty much needed to complete this job. Uh, we got a drain pan, a funnel, one oil filter. You're gonna need six quarts of 5W20 engine oil. Today we're going with the AMS oil signature series 5W20. This oil is good for one year or a minimum of 15,000 miles in severe service or 25,000 miles in normal service. Basic set of hand tools and a lift, jack, jack stands, or ramps will do the trick. This will be the vehicle's second oil change with AMS oil. We already checked the oil level. It was spot on the full mark. Uh, going the full, even a about a thousand miles over the interval actually. Um, still right on the money. Um, we've gone ahead and popped the hood, pulled the dipstick, removed the oil fill cap, and now we can go ahead and insert our funnel. Now we can go ahead, go beneath the vehicle, release the oil filter, and drain the oil. All right, the first thing we're gonna do is release the oil filter. As you can see, it's right there. It's on the front of the engine, right next to the uh, front catalytic converter. Go ahead and grab it and break it free. Make sure you have your drain pan positioned underneath to catch the oil. And then take a rag and grab the filter because it may be hot if you were just got done driving it. There will be more oil that spills. Remove the filter from the spindle and Put the filter in your drain bucket. Now using some uh, engine oil, we're gonna lubricate the uh, seal of our new filter. Also, it doesn't hurt to lubricate the threads. And then install your new filter. Spin it till it bottoms out with the engine. And then give it another three quarters of a turn. <sighs> Wipe the area down. Clean off with some brake clean if needed. After you replace the filter, now you can go ahead and uh, drain the oil. The engine oil drain plug is located on the back side of the engine oil pan, near where the exhaust manifolds come together. Just take your 15 millimeter socket and wrench and break it free. Position your Position your oil drain pan and back the plug out. Again, be careful, this may be hot. And you'll let that drain for about five to 10 minutes. Once you've let it drain and it comes to a uh, very slow trickle, go ahead and reinstall the drain plug Start it in by hand as far as you can. Until it bottoms out with the engine. And take your 15 millimeter socket or a wrench and go ahead and give it a, about a eighth to a quarter of a turn. Wipe up the area. And now we can go ahead and add the engine oil. So again, add six quarts of 5W20 engine oil. If you are interested in using AMSOIL products, I will have several links in the description below. 
Uh, you can check out their inventory or yourself a free catalog. It'll be shipped to your door, no charge. You can become a preferred customer where you'll get 25% off all Amazon products. Uh, the annual subscription fee is just $20. So usually about your first order, the uh, membership pays for itself. Or if you'd like to become a dealer, there'll be a link for that as well. So now we're gonna add six quarts of this oil. Once you're done adding the six quarts, go ahead and remove your oil fill funnel. Reinstall your dipstick. Reinstall your oil fill cap. Now we can go ahead and start the vehicle and do our pressure check. Make sure the filter's not leaking, the drain plug is nice and tight. Make sure everything's good. All right, we're just gonna start it and let it idle. Make sure the oil pressure light goes out. Then we're just gonna get under the vehicle and check for leaks. I don't see any. So now we can go ahead and we're gonna back it off the ramps so the vehicle is level so we can get an accurate oil level measurement. Now we're gonna go ahead and check the oil level. All right, so to check the oil level, go ahead and pull the dipstick out, grab a rag and wipe it clean. Reinsert the dipstick, fully seat it, and then pull the dipstick out. And as you can see right there, six quarts has us right between the fill and the add mark. So six quarts is good. Tidy up, clean up any possible messes you might have made, and that's it. That is how you do an oil change on a 2006 Ford Fusion with the three liter V6 engine. This concludes this how-to. Again, let us know down in the comments how we're doing. Let us know if it was helpful. We greatly appreciate it. And uh, share this video with your friends if you, they could also find it helpful. So thank you for watching. We'll see you in the next one here at the Driver Mod.